In this video we are going to talk about the top 10 oldest buildings in the world. Like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Number 10. Atreus Treasury, Greece. This tomb was built around 1250 BC over 3250 years ago during the Bronze Age. It was the world's tallest and largest dome before the Pantheon was completed. The site with its monumental form and grandeur, is one of Mycenaean Greece's most impressive monuments. The tomb may have housed the remains of the sovereign who finished the fortress reconstruction or one of his successes. The grave is in the theme of Mycenaean Greece's other tholoi, of which there are nine in total around Mycenae's citadel and several more in the Argolid. However because of its monumental form and grandeur, it is one of the most remarkable Mycenaean monuments still standing. The tomb is carved into the incline of a mountain. It is made up of a semi-subterranean space with a circular plan and in a gival corbel arch covering. For over a thousand years it was the world's highest and widest dome with an interior height of 13.5 meters and a diameter of 14.5 meters, before the Temple of Mercury in Bai and the Pantheon in Rome were built. The chamber was built by digging vertically into the hillside similar to a well-then walling, and roofing the space with stone from the chamber's floor level, and eventually backfilling the earth above. Tiers of ashlar masonry were arranged in circles with, each tier projecting slightly further inward until only a small opening remained at the end. There is a triangle-shaped open space above the entranceway. Number 9. Minoan Palace of Knossos, Greece. The Palace of Knossos served as the Minoan civilization's ritual and political base. Around 2000 BC the palace was excavated and partially restored under the direction of Arthur Evans. Its scale as well as the discovery of two ancient scripts he named Linear A and Linear B to differentiate their writing from the pictographs also present, far surpassed his expectations. At some point between 1380 and 1100 BC the palace was abandoned for unknown reasons. The exact date is unknown, but it is assumed to be one of the many disasters that befell the palace. The abandoning population was most likely Mycenaean, Greeks who had previously occupied the city-state, and were using Linear B as its administrative language, rather than Linear A which had previously been used. Number 8. Great Pyramid, Egypt. The Pyramid of Khufu also known as the Khufu Pyramid is the oldest and tallest of the three pyramids in the Giza necropolis, which is located in what is now El Giza, Egypt. It is the oldest of the seven wonders of the ancient world, as well as the only one that has been preserved in its entirety. Egyptologists assume the pyramid was constructed as a tomb for Egyptian pharaoh Khufu of the 4th dynasty over a 10 to 20 year period, ending around 2560 BCE. For over 3,800 years the Great Pyramid was the world's tallest man-made building, standing at 146.5 meters, 481 feet. Number 7. Pyramid of Djosa, Egypt. The necropolis of Saqqara is located in Egypt. Imhotep Pharaoh Djosa's vizier, built the Pyramid of Djosa in the 27th century BC for the burial of Pharaoh Djosa. The first Egyptian pyramid was made up of six mastabas stacked on top of each other. The pyramid was originally 62 meters tall with a base measuring 109 meters by 125 meters. It was clad in white limestone that had been polished. The step pyramid is thought to be the first large-scale cut stone structure ever built. The earliest known stone pyramid structure dates back to 3000 BC, or approximately 4700 years ago. Number 6. Tarkayan Temples, Malta. The Tarkayan Temples are a Maltese archaeological site in Tarkayan. They were created around 3150 BC. In 1980 the site was designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The Tarkayan is made up of three different temple structures that are linked. The main entrance is a 1956 renovation when the entire site was rebuilt. At the same time many of the painted slabs found on site were moved to the Museum of Archaeology in Valletta for safety. The first temple which dates back to around 3150 BC, is the most ornately decorated of Malta's temples. Number 5. New Grange Island. The oldest buildings in Ireland and a prehistoric monument. It was constructed about 3200 BC or up to 5100 years ago during the Neolithic period. New Grange is older than Stonehenge and the Egyptian pyramids. A large circular mound with an inner stone passageway and chambers makes up the structure. Human bones possibly grave or votive offerings were discovered in these chambers. The site is thought to have religious significance, although there is no consensus about what the site was used for. It is now a popular tourist destination. 
prehistorians considered the site to be Ireland's greatest national monument. It was also regarded as one of Europe's most significant megalithic structures. The bones found in the most elaborate chamber belonged to a man whose parents were first-degree kin probably brother and sister according to DNA research. In the past royal dynasties led by god kings such as the pharaohs of ancient Egypt, who married among themselves to keep the royal bloodline pure, were the only ones who practiced inbreeding. This combined with the burial's reputation could indicate that Newgrange was built by a similar elite community. The man was linked to people buried in the Caro Keel and Caro Moor tombs on a distant level. Archaeologist Alistair Whittle on the other hand believes that social divisions in the Neolithic were always transient, speculating that an elite may have emerged in response to the crisis. He speculated that Newgrange was once a communal monument that was co-opted as a personal tomb for a brief period of time. Number 4. La Hougue B. Jersey. In the parish of Grouville, Jersey La Hougue B is a historic site with a museum. About 3500 BC this location was in use an 18.6 meter long, passage chamber is surrounded by a 12.2 meter high earth mound at the site. The Société Jerseyes was the first to excavate the site in 1925. It is one of the largest and best preserved passage graves in Western Europe as well, as the most impressive and well-preserved monument in the Armorican Passage Grave Group. It was used as a main lookout point during World War II, and an underground command bunker was constructed in the mound and adjacent areas. Number 3. Knapp of Hower, Scotland. This is Europe's oldest stone home originally it was part of a Neolithic farmstead. It was standing from 3700 BC to 3100 BC or up to 5500 years ago according to radiocarbon dating. Historic Scotland is now in charge of this venue. It is the third oldest structure on the planet. Number 2. Megalithic Temples of Malta. These temples on the island of Malta are said to be the world's oldest freestanding buildings. The structures were built over a period of about 5,500 years roughly between 3600 BC and 700 BC. Malta's megalithic temples were used as religious temples, and are the world's oldest of their kind. Number 1. Tumulus of Bougain, France. The Tumulus of Bougain also known as the Bougain Necropolis, is a collection of five Neolithic barrows tumulus in Bougain, France. Their discovery in 1840 piqued scientific curiosity. The site was purchased by the Department of De Sevres in 1873 to preserve the monuments. In the late 1960s excavations were restarted. This prehistoric monument's oldest buildings date back to 4800 BC. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comment section below. Be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.